working with building owners and industry professionals. It is crucial when it comes to conserving heritage buildings here in Singapore. Second National Development Minister Desmond Lee made these comments at the Urban Redevelopment Authority's Architectural Awards, where two projects were honoured for their restoration efforts this year. Kelly Wong tells us more. It may be hard to tell, but this building along Dobi Ghat is more than 90 years old. And that's because the Tamasic Shop House recently went for an 18-month facelift. Not only did it preserve the building's distinct architecture, restoration included this 10-meter green wall and a sky garden on the rooftop. All that in a bid to be more eco-friendly. Incorporating greenery internally into the shophouse was quite challenging because of the old existing structures. All these new planters and gardens are very heavy structures that requires uh, you to strengthen some of the structure. So we have to be quite clever in the way we chose the type of plants, the type of, uh, of material that we use so that it's still lightweight. The building was conserved in 2000 for its unique architecture. A heritage gem, it's now a co-working space for social enterprises. And that meant any makeover had to balance between keeping the past and moving with the times. Heritage buildings have the advantage of having long and remarkable histories with plenty of meaningful stories to tell. We find that it's important to retain that legacy and try to keep um, elements as original and as authentic as possible. Those behind the project were the winners of this year's URA Architectural Heritage Awards, which recognizes good restoration practices. Second National Development Minister Desmond Lee highlighted how earlier generations saw the importance of protecting built heritage even amid urban renewal. They recognized that conservation had to be done pragmatically and with careful selection. Buildings needed to serve new purposes with new times and to continue to contribute to Singapore's progress. And development. Special mention also went to this residential shop house at Onan Road. It reinstated the airwell typical of conventional shop houses, paying tribute to its history. The design lets in natural light and ventilation, which URA said also makes it a low energy building. The pre war building was gazetted in 1993 as part of conservation efforts to the Juchiat area.